Many creatures can kill a man, and not only with their teeth like snakes, but with their tail. The desert is alive with living creatures, and a man must know them all. The master nonchalantly rummages among the scorpions in the bowl in front of him. See here, this is its weapon. It can be fatal in a matter of minutes, but I am not afraid because Allah protects me. The Sahara scorpion is the most deadly of the species. Its poison is more lethal than a cobra's. He swallows the venom-laden sting, a demonstration that goes beyond the bounds of imagination. He does it for effect, to astound his pupils and ourselves as we film him, and he succeeds. <laughs> Building up immunity to venoms is essential for a desert hunter. The master invokes Allah's protection before allowing the boy to undergo the test. By absorbing a small quantity of venom daily, a man slowly becomes immune. This immunization process is known as mithridaticism. In an oasis, far from inquisitive eyes, the young men show off their newly acquired immunity. It is a test of strength, a variation on the ancient, harmless game of arm wrestling. But this is a dangerous, sometimes fatal game. Immunization is not always complete. Oh, my God. 